video will help you learn about what an invoice is, different types of invoices and, what all information is available on an invoice like vendor name and address, bill to name and address etc. You will also see examples of images which are not an invoice. This is an invoice. An invoice is a bill issued by a supplier or vendor to a buyer. Generally, the supplier or vendor name will be found on top of an invoice along with or without a company logo. Bill reference or invoice details like invoice number, invoice date, purchase order number will also be found on top. Billing address of an invoice can be found below the supplier name and address. Item purchase details with item number, description, quantity, rate and amount can be found just below the billing address. Net amount, tax amount and total amount can be found below the line item particulars. These are examples of invoices. Invoice can be called invoice, tax invoice, bill of supply. These are also invoices, credit memo, credit note, credit invoice, debit note, debit memos, and freight invoice. All the above examples are valid invoices to be processed. The sample invoice has the following details. Supplier or vendor name and address. Remit to name and address. Invoice number. PO number. Invoice date. Payment terms. Due date. Bill to name and address, chip to name and address, quantity, item or part number, item description, unit price, unit of measurement, extended price, subtotal, freight, tax, and total amount. Let us now see the different field labels, where to find them on the invoice and what to capture. Supplier is also known as seller or vendor. Supplier is the one who supplies goods and services to a buyer. Identification tips generally appears at the top of the invoice, near the company logo. In this image we see four sets of names and addresses. Supplier name and address, buyer or bill to name and address, delivery or ship to name and address, remit to or check payable to name and address. Let us see what to key for supplier name and address. Key the details for supplier name and address as follows, supplier name, Messer LLC, supplier address, 200 Somerset Corporate BLVD, STE 7000, supplier city, Bridgewater, supplier state code, NJ, supplier zip code, 08807, supplier zip code, extension, 2862. Buyer's name and address is where the vendor sends the invoice copy. It is also called bill to or sold to address. Identification tips comes at the top, either left or right, after the supplier details, in most of the invoice templates. Sometimes bill to and ship to address are the same. Example for bill to name and address. Bill to name, BMW Manufacturing COLLC, bill to address, PO Box 11000, bill to city, Spartanburg, bill to state code, SC. Bill to zip code, 29304, bill to zip code, extension, 4100. Delivery address is the place to which goods are shipped by the supplier. Also called ship to or consignee name and address. Identification tips, comes at the top, given next to the billing address, in most of the invoice templates. Example for ship to name and address. Ship to name. BMW Manufacturing Company LLC, chip to address, 1400 Highway 101S, chip to city, Greer, chip to state code, SC, chip to zip code, 29651, chip to zip code extension, 6731. Invoice number, also known as bill number, is a unique, sequential number, numeric slash alphanumeric, assigned to each invoice. Identification tips generally given at the top of the invoice. In this invoice, capture invoice number as 21035008049 key only the numeric value, do not key the word invoice number. If the word invoice number is already populated, then remove the word invoice number. The date marked on a bill or invoice to indicates the data purchase or services rendered. Different date formats are used, DDMMYY. 
or MMDDYY, or DDMMMYY, or YYYYMMDD. You should capture data in the MMDDYYYY format. Identification tips, generally, comes just after the invoice number. Key the date in numbers, 03112021, do not key the word invoice date. If the word invoice date is already populated, then remove the words invoice date. A PO number or purchase order number is a unique number assigned to an agreement or a contract between a buyer and a seller. Identification tips, generally, present near to the invoice number or at the line level. Key the data after the word PO number in this example it is 45006313360, do not key with the words PO number. If the word PO number or purchase order is already populated, then remove the words PO number or purchase order. Payment terms indicates the time given for the buyer to make the payment, and terms such as time given for payments at discounted rates. Examples are Net 30 or 5% 10 days or net 30 days or due upon receipt. Key only net 30 days from this example. Do not key the word terms. If the word terms or payment terms is already populated, then remove the words terms or payment terms. The due date mentioned in the invoice to indicate the last date to make the payment. Identification tips, due date or last date for payment or due on or payment due by or due by are the words given for this. Date format will be MMDDYYYY or MMDDYY so in this example key 07302021. Key only the date 04102021 for this example. Do not key the words payment due by. If the word payment due or due date is already populated, then remove the words payment due or due date. Vendor number is specific to vendors or suppliers. Identification tips from the stamp information or anywhere on invoice. Key from the keywords vendor number or vendor etc. 756279 is vendor number for this example. Do not key the words like vendor, vendor number, etc. If the words vendor number is already populated, then remove the words vendor number. Item code or item number refers to the material number which is applied to a buyer. Identification tips, comes in the middle or body of the invoice. Usually given in a table format. Key only to 5001115 for this example. Do not key the words material number. If the words item number or material number is already populated, then remove the words item number or material number. It is a brief description of the item or material that includes any additional information the buyer should know about the item. Identification tips comes next to item number, usually given in a table format. Key only spacer 6287641 PSR lock port 6x14x11 for this example. This is for first line description. Likewise, key as per the image, shown in snippet for all other lines. Do not key the word, description. If the words description or material description is already populated, then remove the words description or material description. This gives the number of items that have been ordered or shipped. Identification tips comes in the table format, next to item description. Key the number 1 for quantity in first line. Similarly, key for all other lines as per the image shown in snippet. Do not key the word quantity. If the word quantity is already populated, then remove the word quantity. This is the measurement unit used to identify the size weight, dimensions of the goods or materials. Example. Each or e, pound, liter, cc, kilogram. Identification tips, comes next to quantity, usually given in a table format. Key the data CCF for first line UOM. Key other UOMs as per the image shown in snippet. Do not key the word UOM, or unit or unit of measurement. If the word UOM, or unit etc. is already populated, then remove these words. Unit price is the price for one item or measurement, per kilogram, per liter, per meter, etc. Identification tips next to quantity or unit of measurement, usually given in a table format.
Key of the day to 1.29 for first line unit price. Key other unit price values as per the image shown in snippet. Do not key the word price or unit price. If the word unit price or price is already populated, then remove these words. The amount from quantity and unit rate will be calculated and billed. Identification tips next to unit price, usually given in a table format. Key the value 7913.38 for first line amount. Key other amount values as per the image shown in snippet. Do not key the word amount or extended amount. Key only numeric data for line amount. If the word extended price or amount is already populated, then remove these words. The base amount or net amount or subtotal is the total amount excluding the taxes. Identification tips comes below the line items. Key only the amount in numeric value. 8304.44 for this example. Do not key the word subtotal. If the word subtotal, net amount is already populated, then remove these words. Tax amount or VAT amount is billed based on the tax rate percentage. Identification tips, given at the bottom of the invoice or below the subtotal or net amount. Key only the amount in numeric value. 2040.95 is tax amount for this example. Do not key the word tax amount, GST. If the word tax or tax amount is already populated, then remove these words. The shipping slash freight slash transportation or handling charges are the expenses involved in moving products or assets to the delivery location. Fuel surcharge is also a shipping charge. Identification tips comes below the line items. Key only the amount in numeric value. 368.06 This is a fuel surcharge for this example. Do not key the word fuel surcharge slash freight slash handling slash shipping charges. If the word shipping or handling or fuel etc. is already populated, then remove these words. The total invoice amount includes the subtotal and tax amount. Identification tips mostly given at the bottom of the invoice. Key only the amount in numeric value. 8304.44 is the invoice total for this example. Do not key any word like invoice amount or invoice total or any symbols like dollar. If the word invoice total or total amount is already populated, then remove these words. The currency in which amount needs to be paid to a supplier. Example, USD, CAD, GBP, they occur as three-digit alpha or as symbol dollar or euro. Identification tips, usually comes with the total amount. Key only the currency code mentioned on invoice. USD or GBP or CAD or INR etc. Do not key any numeric amount value or keywords like total, amount etc. Remittance to, or, remit to, or, payment to, or, pay to, or, make payment to, or, please remit to is the name and address to which buyer needs to make payment. Key remit to name and address from keyword remit to, payable to, payment to. Remit to name, Messer LLC, remit to address, 88718 Expedite Way, remit to city, Chicago, remit to state, IL, remit to zip code, 60695, remit to zip code extension, 1700. Do not enter keywords like remit to payment to or please make check payable to etc. Sometimes we find images that are not actually invoices. In these images there will be no invoice number, date or bill to or supplier details. These are some samples of images that are not invoices. Hence use hotkeys control plus enter to reject all the invoice related fields in such images. Thank you for watching. We hope you now have a better understanding on the different fields and information available on invoices and how to capture them correctly. All the best.